Hi, Servant Kids Preschool. We are going to have an out of this world new year. But first, let's start off with some amazing worship songs. There is only one who can do anything amazing. There is only one who can do anything so amazing. His name is Jesus. He is the strongest. His name is Jesus. And he is oh so good. Oh, I've got a friend, a friend in Jesus, he loves everything about me. 
very best news in the world Everybody, are you ready? It's a gift for every boy and girl space so much that today I'm making space slime. Here's my recipe. Can you help me count the ingredients? Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Great counting. When we mix this all together, it will make space slime. Here it goes. Glue. <laughs> Ooh, that's icky. <laughs> water, and this stuff to hold it together. What color do you think we should make our space slime? Red, yellow, you know what? I think that space seems kind of blue. I think that's enough. And we definitely need glittery stars in our space slime. That's weird. Is it supposed to be like this? <gasps> I know. We have to mix it up and squish it with our hands. Can you help me squish it? Roll up your sleeves and get your hands ready. Let's squish. Hey, 
I think it's done. This is so amazing. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? Making fun slime, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure am. Making slime is the best thing ever. Mixing up slime is great. Who? Who? And I know something Jesus mixed up too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. Who? Ollie's got a Bible story for me and you. Hola, friends. I'm Luis, the handyman. Look what I'm making for our story today. I'm going to mix this dirt with this water. Watch. <laughs> now, what did I make? Mm, mud! <laughs> That's right. Now, what does mud have to do with the amazing stories we've been learning about Jesus? Well, I'll show you. Are you ready to help me build a story? Great! Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Okay, so today's true story from the Bible begins with Jesus and his friends walking along a road. When Jesus noticed a man, Jesus stopped. Jesus saw that the man was blind, which means that his eyes couldn't see. Now close your eyes for a minute. What can you see? Nothing. You can't see your friends? or your leader, or whether it's sunny or dark outside. Okay, you can open your eyes now. When Jesus saw the man who was blind, he did something really amazing. Jesus spit on the ground, and he turned the dirt into what? Mud! <laughs> Jesus took the mud and put it on the man's eyes. Ooh, let's pretend to put mud on our eyes too. Now put it on your eyes. Ooh. <laughs> then Jesus told the man to go wash his face in the water. Now you need to wash your face in the water. All right, now get this side. And get this other side. <laughs> now open your eyes. The man did what Jesus said. He went and washed off the mud in the water. Guess what? The man could see. The man was so amazed. Jesus is amazing. We've learned a lot about how amazing Jesus is. Jesus is God's son, and he can do amazing things. <laughs> hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. <laughs> That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. See you again soon. <laughs> so there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus mixed mud to help a man see. Jesus is amazing. Ho, ho. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Ho, ho. Wow, Jesus mixed up mud and used it to help a man see. Jesus is so amazing. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Wow, Jesus is so amazing. I know, I can share this slime with my friends and tell them how amazing Jesus is. I'll see you next time, bye! Let's practice our Bible memory verse. It's from Luke 
247. Everyone who heard him was amazed. Thanks for coming to Servant Kids. We will see you next week.